What do Corbin, reindeer, and taxis in New York all have in common? Sex. They're horny. Oh, no. Yeah. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directing. It's Corbin. Ashley. Rick. You know my daughter called me by my first name yesterday? What? Mm -hmm. What was that all about? Yeah, she heard Alexis say it. And then she comes running and she goes, Ashley. Wow. And I was like, no, child. I am mama. <laughs> yeah, did you put her in the pen and lock it again? Yes. Great. 100%. Perfect. That's what you do to correct the kids. Put them in the pen. Lock it and leave them. <laughs> I saw a great... Where do you keep your pen? I saw a great TikTok. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was this guy who's being introduced to his girlfriend's father. Okay. And he says, oh, hello, sir. You know, it's funny. Uh, your daughter calls me the same name. <laughs> now. Wow. Now. Daddy. Now. Uh, now. Wow. <laughs> we got a, uh, Ren Beer did a uh, interview. This is Ren Beer answers most Googled questions. Oh, cool. And obviously, uh, have you seen a Ren Beer film? This is yeah. Ren Beer. Yeah, Tomasha? I don't, guys. I don't remember any of the names. Oh, you know what? I don't think you've seen Tamasha. Yeah, I don't know. What did you see of his? Barfy, Barfy. Yeah, it was Barfy. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I can't ever remember the names, guys. Do you recognize him? Yeah, yeah. Oh That's, yeah. We also known as yeah. Alia Bot's husband. Yep. And oh yes. Baby daddy. Baby daddy. She's prego. He impregnated her. With, that that happens with sometimes. his sperm. <laughs> that means, I hope it was his sperm. Well, we don't know. You know well, what that means? We don't know. You do what you got to do. We don't know. Means they're gonna have a baby. Yes, it does. You are good at science. Thank you. Wow, science. Yeah, Mr. White, science. <laughs> name that. Name that show. Uh, <laughs> Game of Thrones. Yes. Here we go. He has two films coming out. Pretty big ones too. Feel them for at least. Was that a question? <laughs> yeah, I, I guess How many so. Abs does he have? My most and many useless talents. One is. Then um, I do a lot of silly magic tricks. What I do the most of is procrastination. Uh. I just sit on my balcony and I don't think. 90% of the time I have no thought in my head. A lot of people say I'm very lucky, but then that makes you very lazy because you don't get You're a guy. shit done. But I can just sit on my I don't get it. and look endlessly at nothingness. It's one of the best parts about being a guy. I can't think I can't nothing. do that. I can just turn my, my brain off. My first paycheck was a uh, pair of rupees 250 uh, that I got while <laughs> assisting on Prem Grant. Great like picture. Boy, I went to my mother's room and I put it on her feet. And she looked at it, she started crying. And it was one oh, of those that's sweet. that I performed. Oh. Being Ooh. wet. I hate being wet. What? So many films I have, I have rejected because there were underwater scenes. <laughs> Uh, there were a lot of scenes in the rain. I just don't like getting wet. I don't know what's wrong. Like, even if I wash my hair, I have to immediately dry it. I just don't like being wet. Wow. That is so random. Oh. See, but the thing is, I don't post. And I have no followers. So what's the point? Like, I just have the handle so I can follow Mashable. Uh, but other than that, I have nothing, you know? I, I, so there's no, there's no point. But, but never say never. You know, I, I could come, uh, I could make my account public. Uh, but as of right now, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. You know, I'm, I'm doing decently without... He has no social, social media. media. But like I said, never say never. Craziest. Well, craziest, uh, I wouldn't say because it usually is used in a negative way. But I remember like when I started, like in the early years, uh, there was a girl and I never met her. But my, my, my watchman told me that she came with a pandit and she married my gate. Yeah, at the bungalow I used to live with my parents. And uh, there was some tikka on the gate and there were some flowers and all this. So that was quite, I was out of town that time, I think. So that was quite crazy. I haven't met my first wife yet. Okay. Uh, so I look forward to meeting you at some point. This must have been pre Alia. <laughs> wow. None yet. Hopefully soon, yeah. The eight or something, I don't know. Maybe my going to be children's name. Oh. Most embarrassing moment. I don't know if I get embarrassed too easily. Uh, I think compliments embarrass me more than anything else because I don't know how to uh, handle, take a compliment. Uh, so yeah, I think being highly complimented makes me a little embarrassed. Same. Favorite food would be probably bhuji paratha. You know, or just your home dal chawal bindi, some simple chicken curry and achar and piyaz and that's it. You know, that's all you need and some ghee. On top of mm -hmm. that. Always. 
my net worth. I, I really don't care about like money has never been a driving force to me. Uh, I've somewhere I've grown up in luxury, so that's never been something that I have strived for. But I think over the years I've realized my net worth is just equal to the amount of love I get from the audience. You know, when I meet my fans, like today we did a fan event. But it's millions. Yeah. <laughs> but he is a millionaire, folks. I think that's really Let's Google it. Is. My favorite. Ali Abad. Ali One is uh, an actor who I worked on three films with. His name is Saurabh Shukla. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's great. I also said Shum Shera with him. Uh, but I think if I say... Uh, he just said Shum Shera. So I this is a... say um, Anushka Shera. I think uh, we're really close friends and we annoy each other a lot. We keep fighting. And we have a good creative energy between us. So Shamshera is a, is a story about Shamshera, who is the leader of his tribe, the Khmerans. It's his fight against uh, oppressors who have jailed his tribe. And it's, it's about freedom. And like he says that Azadi jiti ni jati, Azadi Azadi. And what it finally says is Karam se dhaket, Dharam se Azadi. Aww. Oh, that's it? Wanted some more. I'm just, I'm just confused. I know. <laughs> because this was... When I don't was know. this? Well, how well, long has he been working on it? I don't know. A long, I think he's been working on it. This was posted June 24th. Uh, 2022. 2022. And he, my future wife, he was yeah. married to Alia by that time and also impregnated her by that time. He, I mean, the public didn't know, but he the, had. They may, have been, they, may, they may have been in a position where he or the production people said, because he mentions the film, wait till the trailer is released before you release the interview. How long Something ago like did that. they get married? This year. this year. Oh, okay. So yeah. it hasn't been that long. We're no, not no, no. Like years. I, they they got married back okay. in. I want to say March. Yeah, it was earlier Yay! this year. Yeah. Yeah. Mowage. Mowage. Newlyweds. Yeah. You Love need to it. see. I'm realizing a couple things, and obviously. You're our, realizing how you failed me. No. Our buddy times and other things have been. You've had some other stuff going on in your life. Popping children out or something. Popping children like out, that. starting your own uh, mama baby business. They're kind of invasive. Yeah. <laughs> children uh, never. And uh, <laughs> what are you talking about? I, I can't, so chill. You really need to see Tamasha. I. Um, you're going to love that movie. Let's do it. And you really need to see the trailer for his new um, movie, Brahmastra. 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 Yeah. It's a massive superhero superhero marvel epic. level here for epic. it um and then this is a different one it's another mm -hmm. epic but i think it's more of a, a you can see this it's a teaser isn't it that we saw no we saw the trailer it was it, a full trailer it comes out the 24th of this month oh that's right we saw both there yeah. was a teaser and then there was the full trailer yeah yeah yeah, yeah. uh we saw them both um what's your favorite ren beer film me uh yes. Tamasha. you over barfy barfy's my favorite priyanka film that's true I'm not talking about performance. I'm talking just the film that he's a part of. Because that's actually a Ren Beer film. He's the star of that one. I feel. No? Favorite um, movie that he has been I know a you part like Priyanka of. Better in it, but. Yeah, it's without Priyanka, that film isn't what it is for me. And I think Tamasha would be what it is, irrespective of the cast. Mm -hmm. um, uh, mm -hmm. Barfi's very dependent on that actor doing a good job in that particular role. I mean, Ren Beer's role is critically important too. Mm. But the for, it's funny because if i mean if i had to choose between those two films which of the two is my favorite um do you need to pray about it first maybe okay i just i love the message lord tamasha <laughs> <laughs> i i really do barfi for me is all about priyanka's performance tamasha for me is the story and since movies are storytelling i would say I was gonna say, uh, it sounds two, like you've made your decision. It's to, it's Tamasha. Tamasha is yeah. a great one. I love Tamasha. Very very true. Yep. And you? <clears throat> yes. Mm. Nice. Anyways, <laughs> let us know. Uh, obviously, besides the new ones, uh, what should be our next Ren Beer film that we should watch? And Ashley, she's coming and do yeah. a review with us sometime. Uh, let us know what it should be down below. Just.